Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. So today we're gonna do a quick food review, which we have not done before, on the special cupcakes that we bought from a special store from Northeast Ohio. And the name of the store is Enticing Cakes. Cakes, cakes. Uh, sorry, it's just Enticing Cakes. So as you can see, I ordered half dozen of cupcakes with different flavors. And as you can see on this particular cupcake, the icing is falling apart for now. But hey, let's go for it. So we actually going to share each cupcakes with you guys, um, how they taste and um, the quality and everything. So don't skip the video. Stay tuned. And we're also going to share uh, the names of the different flavors that I got. Um, so right now I'm just showing how they came. So they do look quite yummy and I'm hoping for the best. And this six cupcakes cost me like around 20 bucks. So like most of you, I'm a chocolate lover, so I'm going to try what's up buttercup uh, flavor first. And as you can see, as I'm opening the paper, the cupcake is falling apart by itself. So you even don't need a knife to cut the cupcake, which is a good thing. So like I said, the name of this uh, cupcake is What's Up Buttercup. And when I tasted the cupcake, um, it was really sweet, which obviously most of the cupcakes should be. Uh, but if I compare the taste, um, I think Walmart has better cupcakes because they are fresh. I mean the Walmart cupcake, not this particular cupcake. So yeah, if you prefer to buy cupcake with yummy and fresh quality, I believe Walmart or Meyer might be a better option instead of just buying it from any other store. So the second one will be the classic vanilla. And um, as you can see, it looks quite good, except the icing, which a part of the icing is missing. So the test was kind of okay, um, not too tasty, not too bad. It was just okay. So now we're going to do uh, the classic chocolate cupcake. And as you can see, we have sprinkles on them as well. The funny part was most of the cupcakes were cracked in the middle, which was kind of weird. Um, I don't really think that's a good presentation. So... Yeah, that's how the cupcakes were presenting. Quite disappointed. And like I said, um, when I tasted those cupcakes, they didn't seem fresh. It felt like they were quite old. Um, I just couldn't feel anything but sweetness. So if you really are craving for something sweet, Maybe you should try cotton candy because 
The tastes are kind of similar in case of sweetness. So now it's the other flavor. And by the way, like most of the cupcakes had a lot of, lot of baking soda on them. And also the smell was coming out of it. And as you can see, another cracked cupcake. I really don't know uh, why so many people gave like five star reviews on this cupcakes. But hey, I'm just showing you what I got. And I'm telling you how they tasted. So this particular one, the sugar-free forest gum or jump, sorry. Um, I thought it, it's really going to be tasty and blah, blah, blah. But again, highly disappointing. Um, as you can see, the cupcake is missing. I don't know, part of the cupcake itself. And I think like the picture that they have uh, put on their website for advertising this picture of the cupcakes and stuff, they're kind of misleading as well. So um, that's not fair also. So the last cupcake, the triple chocolate cupcake, it has a very, very interesting story. So you should focus mainly on this part. So this triple cupcake comes with fungus growing on them. <laughs> and seriously, I mean, oh my gosh, <laughs> fungus. Now, I'm sure you guys know how fungus look like, so that's not a different flavor, by the way, or uh, icing. That's exactly fungus. And as you can see, uh, the icing kind of got a weird uh, white something growing on it as well. Also, they pictured um, like a lots of small chocolate chips on top of this cupcake, but I can see only three bigger ones. And this particular cupcake really kind of you know, um, made me surprised that, oh my gosh, fungus? So yeah, whenever you guys buy any cupcakes or cakes, whatever, please check at the bottom also so you don't eat the fungus. Because <laughs> trust me, that's not good for our stomach. So um, that's our food review, which we are doing it for the first time. I hope you guys will like it and uh, enjoy. Thank you. Bye.